thank, thank you, Mitch, for taking time with us uh, after Lock Vlog, and uh, congratulations on the reverse sweep. What are your initial impressions of the match? Uh, you know, we came out a little flat, uh, starting set one and two. Not a whole lot of energy, and uh, we stayed resilient throughout the whole night. Um, we didn't let the back calls early on really get to us. Um, we kind of moved on. You know, after set two, we're like, all right, you know, we got to push this thing five, but we got to win set three first, and just took care of business point by point. Tell us what uh, Long Beach State did uh, so well in the first two sets that uh, allowed them to take the first two sets. You know, they set the big really well tonight. Um, TJ DeFalco is a great player. You know, he's tough to stop. He was hitting 600 in the first two sets, and that was our biggest challenge. We're like, hey, we got to stop TJ. Um, I think uh, we did a pretty good job in the middle of the court, slowing down their middle attack. It's uh, it's pretty gnarly. Um, they run a really, really interesting system that's really tough to stop. Um, I think we did a good job of neutralizing a little bit uh, later on in the match and a little bit early on too. Um, yeah. You think um, fatigue was it, um, a problem for TJ or their team down the stretch? Uh, you know, I don't really know. Um, I wasn't on that side of the court, so I can't answer that question. Um, you know, I think we just were resilient and just made him you know, beat us. We served him a lot. Um, you know, we made him, you know, get a lot of balls. Uh, I think we stuffed him a good many times. Um, we didn't let him get as many kills in the last three sets, and that was really important. Can you give us your opinion of the officiating tonight? It looks like both teams had a lot of uh, objections to certain uh, calls tonight. Yeah, you know, that happens. Um, you just got to kind of roll with it, let it go off your back. You can't really control it. Um, and, you know, I think uh, we may have done a little bit better job of that than them, and that could have been a reason why uh, we got the victory tonight. Um, but, you know, those are things you can't really worry about, like I said. And uh, would you ca characterize uh, this match as your first uh, test of the year? And if so, how do you uh, feel like uh, you uh, did with this test? Uh, you know, I think every match has its own individual test within it. Um, you know, every night we got to come out and play. Uh, when we wear UCLA on our jerseys, you know, people are coming for us. You know, our program is prestigious. Uh, playing in Poly Pavilion is a big deal for a lot of people. You know, we got to come out here and we got to defend our territory. We got to go into other people's gyms and really just take it match by match. Um, you know, this is a great test for us. Long Beach is a heck of a team, man. They're good, they're tough to stop. Um, and we got it done tonight, so I'm proud of my teammates. And this, uh, Friday night you play CSUN, it'll be your fourth match in six nights. Uh, is fatigue an issue? Um, how, how are you guys preparing for CSUN um, to, uh, tomorrow night and on uh, Friday morning? Yeah, you know, fatigue has uh, been a big part of you know our last week or so. We've had four matches in six or seven days. Uh, it's grueling. Uh, but earlier this year we went back east and we played George Mason, Ohio State, Penn State. Um, I think within four four days I believe uh, and that kind of you know prepared us for this kind of stretch you know we're in the middle of midterms so I know we're grinding things out yeah I got to go back and write a paper I know Mike has got to write a few papers this week um, so I think we're doing a really good job of really prioritizing things taking care of our bodies uh, getting in the gym getting the reps we need uh, but not too many reps to tire us out so I'm proud of our guys well thank you for taking time with us and congratulations yeah. again on the reverse sweep thank you very much